Hey guys, welcome to another Server Miner plugin tutorial. I'm your host LCGym007 and today we're looking at, finally, a decent auction house plugin. So as the name would suggest, this plugin allows your players to auction off their items to make a bit of cash in game. It's super straightforward, really easy to use, it has a nice GUI, so let's just jump straight into it. So the main command is forward slash AH and as you can see it's currently disabled so the way we toggle that on and off is with the AH toggle command. So now we can do forward slash AH, that's going to bring up our GUI and it's going to show you what is currently being sold. So I've put three items on the market. If we hover over them, it's going to say the seller, the category, the buy now price and when it expires. Obviously, I can't buy my own listing and we can check the other ones as well, which are different prices and different expiry times. You can obviously change that. And then on the left, what we can do is select different categories. Now, most of these categories are empty. What you can do is go down to the bottom and search for a particular item. So if I was to type in sword, you can see the diamond sword I'm selling will pop up and obviously any other ones. And then you can also filter newest or oldest. Then over here, we have our profile, which we can have a look at. Now you can also do a H profile to get to this page. And as you can see, there's a few things here. So we can look at our listings and you can click to cancel one of them if you want and there it is gone if we go back we've got a collection box anything we've won in here but obviously no one else is selling anything expired listing so the one we did and now we can reclaim that as it did not sell and then our history these are all the ones that we've listed or cancelled now if we do for slash ah help it's going to bring up all of the commands now a lot of these can be done in the gui that we just saw but if you want to use the command you can do it this way instead now finally, the last command is the AH sell command followed by a price. So I'm going to sell this for $199, this single emerald. Hit enter and it's going to bring up a GUI. Now there's a few things in here. It's going to show you the item and the amount. Do you want to post an advert? Now you can change the price of this in the config file. By default it's $100 and then up here you can right click to remove time, an hour. You can shift right click to remove 30 minutes and then you can left click to add an hour. So by default it is two days but you can keep right clicking to uh, reduce it to whatever amount you want. If you're happy with that, you can hit create listing. And then you can see that I didn't actually post an advert because I don't have enough money for that. We have three out of three active listings. So I've just added some money to my balance. So now if I were to sell this item for a dollar, for example, and let's make sure we post the advert, hit enter. You can see this is what everyone will get in their chat. It will say, uh, LCG has made a new listing on the auction house, golden sword for a dollar. Click message to view the listing. Obviously, um, it's my own, so I cannot buy it. But that is an additional way to get people's attention, but obviously can cost you. Now, finally, we've got H reload. If you made any changes to the config file, which is where we're heading now. So here we are in the SM Picnic control panel. And as you can see, there's a few folders and a few YML files. And then if we jump into the config.yml, this is where we can change stuff. So enabled, yes, listing minimax price. So $1 to, what's that? 100 million or something and then default max listings so you can change that um, and then also change the decimal format then we have the listing adverts so we had a look at that briefly and it's hundred dollars by default you can change that and whether it's default yes or no then we have the different categories that we saw then we have the language file which is just everything that's going to be shown in chat here we are on the speaker page you can see it's updated from 1.16 to 1.21 and down here we can see the features, the commands and permissions. It's a very simple plugin as you saw, but it works fantastically, built really well. I would highly recommend it. But if you need a server to host it on, check out serveminer.com for the best and cheapest hosting around. That's it for me. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.